two. Hey, Pastor. Hi, Ma. What are you reading? Oh, I'm reading from the Bible. The Bible? Yeah, this is from Matthew chapter 18. Oh. At that time, the disciples came to Jesus saying, Who is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven? And calling to him a child, he put him in the midst of them and said, Truly I say to you, unless you turn and become like children, you will never enter the kingdom of heaven. Whoever humbles himself like this child is the greatest in the kingdom of heaven. So children are great in the kingdom of heaven? Yeah, they're not only great, they're the greatest. Greatest? That's like the best. Oh, wow. Hear that, kids? Why, why do you think that might be? Well, I don't know. Why is that? Because, well, because little children believe without doubting. Oh. You know what doubting is? Yeah, that's when you not sure that something's true or not. Yeah, and you, you kind of pretend, you kind of like, well, maybe it's true and maybe it's not, uh, yeah. and I'm not sure. Yeah. But little children believe in Jesus without doubt. Well, That's, that, I, ma that makes them great. I must be like a little child too, because I have no doubt Jesus is my savior. That's right. You are kind of like a little child and yeah. you do believe yeah. So you are great in the kingdom of heaven. <laughs> in fact, it says, whoever receives one such child in my name, Jesus says, receives me. So Jesus is going to come to you. I know. I'm excited and I am great. Yeah, you are great. And all children who believe in Jesus are great in the kingdom of heaven. Hear that, kids? Yeah. A lot of people think it's, a lot of people think, well, it's the adults that are important. Nah. Nah. They're not as important as the kids. That's what it says there. That's what it says. Because the kids believe without doubt. And you too can follow Jesus like a little child without doubt. Have a good week. Bye. Bye.